Hi, it's John. I want to detail um, a maybe a discovery, but something I've been working with Apple on. I have a sound bar that I have a picture of, and it's connected by an auxiliary cable to uh, an Airport Express. And the um, the technology and connection we've created could have a momentous. Um, have a, a definite improvement to the Apple TV eventually uh, if it's added to a different uh, Apple TV or not. I have the HD Apple TV, the fourth generation. And what we did was um, I downloaded a new operating system that I proposed, which was to make the connection with the Wi-Fi uh, speaker um, which is my soundbar, which doesn't have Wi-Fi enabled to it, but is able to do it through AirPlay through the Airport Express with the auxiliary cable connection. And the um, the connection uh, stays on when the it turn the Apple TV turns off. So say. Um, I have the Apple the TV is still on but the Apple TV is turned off and I turn it on and the screen comes up and then the sound starts playing if say I'm in the middle of a song or a playlist or something uh, the only problem right now is the uh, the the connection with the uh, YouTube app and sometimes the YouTube TV app uh, break off with um, this Wi-Fi speaker airplaying to to the to the Apple TV and it goes back to um, the T the TV sound which is the TV volume on the actual TV itself not the Apple TV but the TV itself so uh, what I propose is to try and make adjustments um, in, in the apps that are on Apple TV to make this type of technology more consistent. And uh, what I also noticed with this new technology is that the sourcing is streamlined. So um, the Apple TV, uh, when you go when you go to the sourcing menu, the uh, you, you can select uh, an air AirPlay device that has audio. So say if it's called John's, John's Soundbar like I showed before, showed in the image on here. The um, it, it doesn't keep the sourcing for the TV, it automatically switches off. So there's kind of a play playful there, playfulness there. And I think um, this this could help uh, a lot of people but certainly I had the idea for it and they had the talk technology available but I'm not sure how much testing they actually get done in the field with um, Comcast great internet great wiring like we have in our house I sit up in a room um, and the modem that provides the internet is all the way downstairs which I set up myself and purchased myself and uh, a lot of the YouTube TV and stuff like that are, are, are getting a better connection. Um, so there's a lot of things that you can do that I've worked on and not quite perfected, but it's about 90 to 95 percent there in terms of viability. And you can also use it in any market as long as there's internet connection and you can have a Apple products and third-party devices like like a soundbar that has an auxiliary capability um, depending on how big it is I, I realize there's a you can use Bluetooth and apparently that's more that's they they told me that was more viable but this is what I invested in and um, Bluetooth does not provide internet to uh, the Apple TV and the Wi-Fi Airport Express does, so that's why 
the airport Wi-Fi is better. It uh, it provides better. Um, it provides internet throughout the house wherever you have a, a set a setup. If you have one of these bigger houses like we have at, at my parents' house uh, that I've developed this uh, this system. Um, you can have a, you can buy an airport express or I mean um, yeah an airport express for like a hundred bucks or a hundred ten dollars uh, or whatever the newest thing is and uh, put a few of them around the house to cover the area wherever you have an internet output and I even set up one with the help of Apple to set up with my airport base station and um, it's a floating internet if it gives internet but it's floating connection it's not connected from an ethernet through the wall connection so that's that's also it's kinda of like a space station I guess and I named my Apple TV space station because I want to be able to differenti differentiate it and you can do that type of stuff with your with even with the Airport Express Wi-Fi device. Um, it's all integrated, and as long as you're on the same Wi-Fi, you have a a clear and good connection. So I might be hard on some people sometimes. I want to apologize. I don't. I you know I'm successful even if I have to pay a little bit more in taxes. I don't really have a high salary right now, but um, I'll take what I can get. I, I realize we got to do stuff for the greater good, and that's kind of why I put so much money and time towards. I have the same TV since I was 16. I traveled with it in my Mustang in the back of the car um, around the southeast to get to Georgia and back to Texas. And that's just a little bit of my story of how I became like a true coder uh, by developing hardware and software connections that that work very well. And a lot of this editing I'm doing is not possible without current social media and um, internet connection uh, that that's available to us nowadays. So. Uh, I'm I'm talking freestyle, you know. If I had to write a script and read something off a prompter, I'd probably be um, better at it. But uh, the Wi-Fi connection is improving. Before the YouTube would like switch off to back to the TV connection, like I said from the the audio and the speaker to the audio and the TV speaker but uh, now it'll switch to TV and at least maintain the video before it was completely shutting off on YouTube and you have to press the uh, the back button or the menu button to get back out of it and start it over again and reconnect your speaker you still have to reconnect the speaker and all these things but it's, it seems to me that uh, the connection is becoming viable and I'm probably getting some uh, adjustments from uh, whoever it is, Apple or, or, or whatever the technology. And um, we live in a great time. I, I detailed in my Facebook that I, I'm, I'm pretty healthy now. Um, I have numbers that show that since, uh, since I, 2017, um, my blood and heart rate and blood pressure have all improved and uh, I, I think I could play sports again but that's like me being a little crazy I'm a kind of a f flight flying guy and um, uh, technical guy so I think um, if I got tapped on the shoulder to go to Mars I might be able to do it, but I'm not going to like put all my eggs in that basket. I really want to have a good life. So I'm hard on, on Biden, but I think he'd forgive me for it. Um, I'm not a, a bad guy. I just get frustrated because I'm single at 33 
and not really single, but not married, so, um, this is my gift to the world. If we can create a better connection and a better experience in, in any type of home, even if you live in a one-room apartment, you can get an Airport Express, an Apple TV, and a big speaker, um, or like a condo or something that's got thick walls and doesn't blow out your neighbor's hearing, <laughs> you can you can make uh, quite a movie theater system yourself. A lot of these guys want to be home theater people. I kind of do that. I did it for my house. I, I retrofitted speakers in the ceiling into a speaker diagram is what I call it. And um, it's, a, it's quite the surround sound that um, you would not expect. Um, it's kind of like a movie theater downstairs and upstairs. It's like a concert hall. So um, maybe I'll have a dance party here like I did before. Uh, maybe, maybe if I get married, we'll have people over at the house. And I'm, I trust that'll be okay. I've had people over before and they've always been too nice. So um, this is pretty cool. I think uh, I've accepted my, my, um, my life and I think uh, at 33 my prospects are good even if I go live on Mars the rest of my life. So they say you won't be able to come back if you can't make your own fuel. And um, there's always a risk in a mission like that. But uh, this is this is my gift to the world. If if they could figure out what I did, or I could teach them what what I did, and um, we can make a bases of operations, or like this kind of technology, it's probably more energy efficient. I know if you're paying for cable or dish or something you're probably paying for a cable box to rent it out it's renting essentially and what we were doing before is we had six boxes cable boxes on all the TVs and they're all old TVs and they all didn't play correctly but we were paying 20 bucks a piece um, I just found out the other day that we had two modems of Comcast that we didn't even need and I returned those and I'm, I feel badly about it. I, I don't think they didn't get damaged, so we may have got a refund. But little things you learn every day. I learn how to treat people correctly. I calm down. I calm down a lot. And um, the space race is on, essentially. But this. Uh, this this technology is trademarked by the United States of America. I don't think anybody can foresee. I work. I, f I messed with Wi-Fi in college, and I had everything wired to my speaker. And they're saying, "Why can't you use Bluetooth?" Well, it doesn't have Bluetooth, but it has auxiliary cable, and it's too nice of a speaker to just say, "I'm gonna sell that and get a Bluetooth one and do all this work." when they can make adjustments on this operating system or make a new operating system that works with my 4K, my either the 4K box, a new Apple TV or the fourth generation Apple TV or all three of them to where you have uh, more connectability with your entertainment experience and even I have DVDs. I have DVDs of me playing football. I made varsity and I touched the ball a couple times. I even got a tackle on offense. So I stopped a guy from uh, running for a touchdown. And um, that's probably my fault, though, that he even got the ball. So that's why I don't play football. And I uh, mess with... Uh, electric stuff anyway so there's a lot of stuff going on and I think um, I trust that every 
type of an administration would be for what the ransomers do. And I think that's why um, it'll be a good process of making uh, making environments where um, people can feel happy and joyous all the time. They can select the type of music they want. Oh, and I, I didn't say this, but the iTunes, my iTunes music is seamless on this new system. So the TV turns off, it can turn off automatically on a switch on the Apple TV and the speaker stays on. I can even turn off this speaker's power and turn it back on uh, with the standby button and it'll still be connected because because the Airport Express is the one that houses the connection. So that's my um, finding and I've, I've you have a video of me speaking it and uh, it has come to fruition and I think it could come to markets pretty soon so uh, don't forget to um, save your money up for internet TV and all I have from Xfinity is mobile phones and cable internet and the cable internet is fast if there's a faster cable internet I would take it but this is the cheapest thing I can find right now and um, our bills have subsequently gone way down and we're making more money and the economy is better even Trump had something to do with that um, I think Biden can improve the stock market has gone high and I think this uh, this announcement will will help it out even more.